Hi, my name is Alex Carlucci with Gus and Show Associates. I want to talk to you about non-QM loans, how we lost them. A lot of you already know that, that non-QM just kind of disappeared as soon as COVID shut down, bam, the loans were gone. So non-QMs are the types of loans where you've been late on your mortgage like four times in the last year, they'll still do it. One day out of bankruptcy, one day out of foreclosure. Those loans are going to be gone for a long time, those tough ones like that. But Right now, I hear they're going to roll out in the next few weeks, 35% down bank statement program, 35% down payment, uh, full back with, let's say, a foreclosure over four years ago, and 35% down asset depletion. Those are the only three loans I hear they're going to do right now, and you need a 680 credit score or better. That's going to be the first start they're going to roll out. As they start getting more confidence, investors want these riskier loans, then I think we're going to get all the products slowly back. I don't know when, hopefully six months. It's again, this is a confidence thing in the secondary market. They just want to make sure there's not millions of foreclosures and millions of job losses that are permanent. So those are the things that these non-QM investors that didn't want to buy these loans, it would cause them to disappear so, so quickly. It's just purely confidence in the economy going forward. Because someone who has five lates on the mortgage, might be the guy who's going to foreclose first over the guy who's got 800 credit scores and does a full VAC loan. So the non-QM loans, it's going to take a while for them to come back. We're going to have some kind of skeleton version of it in the next 30 days, I'm hearing. Let's give us a call. We'll let you know. We'll give you all the updates. You can call me anytime, 630-915-7550. That's non-QM effects on the coronavirus. Thank you.